Hey y'all, it is Glam Game Rebecca, and in today's episode, this is actually number 20 on my Terran list. Uh, this is a sinister turn. I have three more episodes to edit, and then we kind of go into like the after stuff, which is char. Um, I had stopped recording these for a while because I had so many that I had to like edit and get up and whatnot that I just didn't have the time to record and whatnot between all the work that I was doing. And then my editing software just kind of up and stopped like the second, uh, beginning of the first week of October, like into the second week, I got a couple of videos edited and then it just kind of stopped working. I couldn't export, I couldn't um, save anything. Everything that I did was just kind of sitting there. I couldn't even upload stuff directly to YouTube. So it was kind of an issue. So that's why there hasn't been any videos in ages is because I couldn't edit anything until they fixed their freaking program. So here we go with another episode. This will go up on a Saturday. gathered allies, and we made our way to the forbidden archive world of Zakul. There, a triumvirate of mystic preservers awaited us, and in the shadows, something else was watching and waiting. All right, Zeratulo, buddy, you got your mysterious prophecy. Now let's see what your preservers made of it. My quest to decipher the prophecy took me to the forbidden archive world of Zakul. Here, three immortal preservers guarded ancient knowledge. Only they could transcribe the prophetic fragments. I needed to seek them out quickly. All right, so this video um, was like 40 minutes long. I got it down to 26 minutes. Um, there's quite a like, bit of little cutscenes and stuff in here where like they're talking back and forth. So I kind of left all those in and I sped up the other parts times two. This map is super easy. I don't even really need to do a voiceover because there's three places that you have to go give power and then basically you just beeline it to the bottom of the map and go take out Big Ugly and then you're done. Um, and there's not really like a whole lot of stuff that you actually have to do to, to get this complete. You just kind of build up and when Big Ugly starts to come, you just know that you kind of have to meet him away from your base or build um, those cannons and stuff at your entrance when you're first starting out. And then just go give uh, power to the other three buildings and make sure, I mean, if you want to do what I did where I took out the other bases, you can do that too. And hopefully this is helpful to you guys. I mean, I am not gonna do any more talking in this video. It is pretty self-explanatory. Um, it's a super, super easy map. Um, it's a little frustrating at first, kind of getting started with Bug Ugly coming at you. But other than that, it's basically you unlock those three buildings, you take out one of the, the other Protoss bases and you beeline it to the bottom of the map. And it's just that easy. So, Hopefully you guys like this episode. Again, this is called A Sinister Turn, and here we go. Hopefully you guys are ready. It is strangely silent here, yet these structures are intact. With power, they would be functional.
mighty spirits of the Preservers are imprisoned close by. We must find them. You have not enough minerals. You have There are many abandoned structures in this place that we can make use of. They merely need their power restored by the construction of a few well-placed pylons. You have not enough minerals. You have not enough minerals. The preservers you seek serve a higher power now, Dark One. Higher power? What could have corrupted these Protoss so? Truly, something foul has taken hold of this sacred place. My life for I. and Zerg hybrid. Gods, an abomination. Who created this atrocity? Come, my slaves. The time has come to give me your strength. facility. This structure may prove useful to us. I am the heart of darkness. You have not enough minerals. A dark shrine. Once power is restored, it could be of great value to us. State thy bidding. I return to serve. My thanks, mighty one. We embrace the glory of our minerals. I like the fire. I am not the darkness. You have not enough minerals. I shall return. The hybrid is draining the preservers to survive. I must free them before it is too late. I am here. 
here in the shadows. Zeratul, truly fate has sent you here. Join me, brothers, and we shall cleanse this place of evil. Command us. This Templar archive lies abandoned. Let our enemy know our fury. Merely a temporary setback. Come, my slaves. The time has come to give me your strength. is at hand. Ready yourself, noble warrior. We confront a terrible evil this day. Some secrets must remain hidden. My charge. 
The enemy closes! Cease your foolish struggle. There is no hope. of the preservers are entombed within. We must break them open immediately. Oblivion comes 
Zerg Overmind. It has a part to play in this prophecy. I must seek out the Overmind's final resting place, our ancient homeworld of Iyer. Level 800, Elite Torrent Chieftain is back with a new album, Pulse Pounding Rock, that will shake the galaxy. Rock out with such hits as Rogues Do It From Behind, Terran Up The Night, Another Hydralisk Bites The Dust, Saturday Night's All Right For New King, Lucy In The Sky With Mutus, Every Rose Has Its Thor, Touring In Your Galaxy, No! business. What's up, cowboy? You know, you're looking kind of rough lately. Rougher than usual, I mean. I've, uh... Got a lot going on right now, Swan. You know how it is. Yeah, sure. You know, you might want to try laying off the sauce. And getting some shut-eye once in a while, huh? Thanks, Mom. I'll get right on that.
Welcome back, sir. What did you discover from the crystal this time? It's that obvious I used it, huh? Zeratul took the prophecy fragments he found to a temple? Library? Kind of both, I guess. But this weird protoss zerg hybrid had taken over the place. You mean some sort of infested protoss? No, this wasn't like infestation at all. It was like someone took the strengths of both races and twisted them together. I gotta tell you, if these things are real, we're in a lot of trouble. <laughs>